I have found it. I have found something that have, has been talked about in my Chinese classes for a long time, and I have complained about how there are so many words in Chinese that are the same sound for many, many different meanings, and I found it. I found it. I, I found it on Good Job Brain, a podcast um, that's now they, they've stopped making shows. Anyway, good, great podcast, but I found it and um, I am gonna play it for you. And you will finally get to hear the thing that I've been talking about all this time. Here goes. Sorry, the sound quality is just gonna be kind of poopy, but you'll get the point. First the guy will read it in English and then the girl will read it in Chinese and you'll, you'll, you'll understand. <laughs> Uh, a poet named Xi lived in a stone house and liked to eat lion flesh, and he vowed to eat ten of them. He used to go to the market in search of lions, and one day at ten o'clock he chanced to see ten of them there. Xi killed the lions with arrows and picked up their bodies, carrying them back to his stone house. His house was dripping with water, so he requested that his servants proceed to dry it. Then he began to try to eat the bodies of the ten lions. It was only then he realized that these were in fact ten lions made of stone. <laughs> so that's that's what this means. But now Karen will read um, this is what it sounds like. Well, it's kind of hard. And then uh Okay, hopefully you see what I'm talking about. 56 different meanings of shu or something? Too many. 